Okay, now we're going to demonstrate an inboard wrist lock switching into a party flex, which is sort of a variation of an outboard wrist lock. He grabs my wrist. I apply the technique, the inboard wrist lock. I rotate over. Both hands are applying the pressure. Now, very importantly, what I do is I take my thumb and I hook into his. My thumb is going to be up. I sort of hook in right here into the curve with his thumb. And I take and take my right hand, strike his elbow, but striking the bend, not on the straight side, striking the bend because it's going to help to flip up his hand into a party flex. From right here, his wrist is up, my wrist is on the back of his, and I still have maintained a grip on his thumb. All I do is sort of like uh, using like a motorcycle, revving up a motorcycle, you take and just sort of pull in a little bit, and of course it causes a lot of pain, it's a very painful technique. Um, from here, let's do it again, let's slow it down just a little bit more. As I apply this technique here, this is the most important part, I just want to reiterate this, is to get your thumb inside his. Your thumb's going to be on top here. And so that when you grab, you're grabbing his thumb and striking. Now, from here, there is a possibility that you can miss the hand. You still have the thumb though. But what you want to be able to do is allow his hand to circle around so that it is cupped into your wrist. And from there, all you have to do is rotate very very small motion to be able to get such a, a effective technique out of that so that's how you transition from an inboard wrist lock into what we call a party flex